Good morning, guys. Good morning. Hi, Kelly Dunlap here. Sorry, I'm a couple minutes late. Hi there, good morning. My name is Kelly Dunlap. I am a Purple Status Unique presenter, and I'm a retired personal trainer. So I come on here every Monday, Wednesday, Friday morning at 5.30 a.m. and on Saturday mornings. Hi, Mindy, how are you? Sorry, I'm a little bit late this morning, you guys. <laughs> I woke up late, and I'm surprised I'm even on here at 5.35. Welcome, we broadcasters. I just wanted to um, also tell you guys to make sure to subscribe to thefitygal.com for my weekly emails. And uh, we're going to do a 30 minute workout. I do workouts for all levels. So uh, today we're going to do um, our cardio and sculpting intervals, mostly sculpting. So again, if you're just joining, my name is Kelly Dunlap. Please subscribe to thefitygal.com and um, also hop on to my uh, workouts every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I'm just waking up. I woke up a little bit late. So I was like, oh my gosh, I'm surprised I'm, I'm on here on time. So, okay, so we gotta get going because like I said, I'm a little bit late here and um, we gotta get started. So make sure you guys have some water nearby, a set of light dumbbells, and we're gonna get going. We're gonna do one minute intervals, which by the way, I need to reset my timer here. Oh, thanks, yay. Okay, so we got that set, and we are going to get going, guys. So we gotta get, get going. Like I said, I'm on here a little bit late. So, okay. So let's do like a three to five pound dumbbell, you guys, and we're gonna get going here. All right, well, thanks. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's get warmed up and get started here. I know it always looks so weird when I come on first thing because my ceiling's really low and I got the camera right there. So, okay, so let's get rolling. All right, here we go. Eight, seven, six. Just get that heart rate going, guys. Three, two, don't forget, go to thefitygal.com. You guys, to subscribe, you get my weekly email. Three, two, and let's do some heel digs. Just move those arms. All right, four, three, two, march it wide for eight, seven, six, five, four. So we're just gonna do some quick shoulder rolls. Here we go for eight, seven, six, Five. I, I uh, wrote out the workout last night really late and I was falling asleep, so I hope I can read my writing. <laughs> Shoulder rolls forward. Six, five, four, three, two, and last one. Side to side. All right, guys. Now we're gonna take that arm, we're gonna reach over and switch and reach and switch again and reach and switch awesome okay guys we're ready to go let's do this so we're gonna start with we're gonna go side squats with the shoulder squeezing in so I'm gonna grab my three pounds so you want to have your arms like nice and boxy on this one so it's gonna look like this you're gonna go side squat out and in okay out and in just like that okay the lower that you go on the squats is going to determine your result. Um, my knees are bothering me today. I don't know if it's the weather or what it is, so I'm not going to be going as low. But I always make sure to tell you guys to either, you know, you modify it to your level, okay? This is for all levels. Okay, here we go. One minute. Let's do this. What we're going to do is we're going to do one minute train or one minute working, and then. We're just gonna do a 10 second transition to the next move, okay? All right, so out, box it in. Out, box it in. Okay, so see how I'm not coming out of that squat. I'm keeping constant tension where I'm staying nice and low. Well, I'm not really super low, but what I'm not doing is I'm not coming out of it and then going back into it. So I'm staying in it, keeping the tension on those thighs. But I can feel my knee, for whatever reason, it's a little bit angry this morning. Keep it going. 10 more seconds, guys. 
boy, oh boy, you can feel your shoulders burning on this one. All right, perfect. Now, our next one is going to be, we're gonna do rear delts. Okay, looks like this. You're gonna go rear delt in, rear lunge, rear delt, rear lunge. Okay, with your arms going straight up. One minute of that, you guys ready? And there's really no 10 second transition because I have to teach you the next move. <laughs> so just know that each move we're doing, we're doing for one minute, okay? All right, ready? And here we go. All right, so rear, got it? So you're doing rear delt, rear lunge to shoulder, okay? Get low on those lunges. I just uh, moved myself so that I can go back a little bit deeper. When you go into that lunge, really, oops, really make sure that you keep your abs tight, just like I did it there a second ago, and you'll lose your balance if you don't. Keep your abs nice and tight, go nice and low. Get a good stretch here in that hip flexor in the front of the hip and the thigh. Okay. Alternating those legs. Oops. Keep it going. Should we get nice and warm by now? Nice job. Okay. Next. We're going to go just to a plie to an up row. All right. Easy breezy. How you guys doing, okay? All right. Toes are out nice and wide. So, plies. Toes are out. You're gonna drop and lift. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Now, you can, if you want, stay in this position and just meaning that you're gonna have an isometric leg, meaning that's not moving, and your arms are, or you can move both, whatever you decide to do, okay? I'm gonna choose to move because I wanna try to go lower each time, but make sure that you are keeping your head, neck, and shoulders lifted, that you're not leaning over. A lot of people have a tendency to do that. So you wanna keep it lifted, abs are nice and tight. Doing good, you guys. Abs are tight, whittling the middle, okay? Come on guys, pull it up. Remember, what we're working on now is gonna show up towards the summer months, okay? All right, and what's showing up now is work that we've been putting in the past few months. Okay, now, talk test. Do you feel a little bit breathless? If somebody came in the room and wanted to hold the conversation, would you be annoyed? Like, don't talk to him right now. I'll talk to you a little bit later, right? That's what you want to be. Okay, where you want to be. Next. Okay. Okay, now. We're going to go into a stationary plea. I'm going to take both of my dumbbells in one arm. Or, yeah. So I'm going to come over here. I'm going to come across. We've done these before. You, they should be familiar to you. And you're going to come over and you're going to do a bicep curl. Okay? Keep your abs nice and tight. We're just doing a concentration curl here on that bicep. All right, you got it. Now what we're gonna end up doing is we're gonna go back to that plie up row and we're gonna do the other side for the bicep. Okay? Whew. Nice job, guys, keep it going. I thought for sure my kiddo was going to have, my kids were going to have a snow day today. It's pretty crappy out there today, but no call from the school. What about you, Mindy? Did you kind of think the same thing? It's pretty crappy outside. Keep it going. This is a tough one. You got 10 seconds. You can do this. I know this is tough. Your legs are probably shaking. Come on, three, two, one. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, so now we're gonna go back into the plie up row and then we're gonna go to the other side, okay? 
I know we're doing that plie one twice, but who cares? Okay, here we go. Let's do this. All right, so you can even do one arm on this one, or you could stick to, to both arms, and you could, again, like I said, go into that stationary if you want to. You got it. Perfect. Come on, guys. Keep it working. All right, squeeze. Really squeeze that inner thigh and your glutes on these. Keep it up. 10 seconds. Almost there. Pull. Pull. Good job. Okay, now we're going to do the other side. Stationary plies to the bicep. Get some water if you need it. All right, I gotta check out what we have up and coming here. So we're gonna go into the other leg with the other bicep. Okay, so we're halfway there. Okay. All right. Here we go. Stationary plie, left arm. Let's go, guys. Let's do it. Okay, perfect. Awesome. You got it. Keep those abs nice and tight once again, you guys. If this is too difficult for you, then you could just come up and, you know, go into just a higher plie and just work that bicep that way. Here, we're engaging more. You know, we're going lower, engaging more muscles this way. We are in that isometric hold if you need to. You can even do something like this, just to kind of give yourself that little bit of a break if you need it. Only if you need it, but just don't give in because you don't feel like doing it. You know what I'm saying? That's the, that's the thing, is you gotta mind over matter, you know? Almost there. Woo-wee, good job. Okay, so, you should be nice and, uh, Warm, breathless a little bit, little uh, hard time holding a conversation, right? Okay. All right, guys. I'm feeling a little bit of sweat back here coming. Next. All right. Okay. That's what we're going to do, guys. All right. So we're going to go into, you're going to go um, narrow row, wide row. Got it? Narrow, wide. That's it, okay? Simple. Keeping it simple today. Simple and effective. Okay, here we go. One minute. Lean it forward, guys. Wide, narrow. Wide, narrow. You got it. If you wanted to, you could even add some legs in here, meaning like go down, down. See what I'm saying? optional. Got it? I think I'm going to add a little bit of that leg work in there because I kind of feel guilty when I know that I have a body part that I could be utilizing and it's just laying there <laughs> or not moving, you know? You got it. Come on, guys. You could do it. Perfect. Come on, work it. Almost there, we gotta be, I can feel this. Every time I check my clock, we either have 10 seconds or three seconds left. <laughs> it always seems to be the pattern. Okay, what do I have here? All right. Okay, lean forward to, see this is where my handwriting starts getting a little bit crazy. I'm like. I remember last night falling asleep going, uh oh, I hope I can read this tomorrow. Okay. All right, now what we're gonna do, you guys, is we're gonna just, we're gonna do the other side, okay? 
because we, we work that other leg. So we're gonna do the other side. All right, so other leg is gonna go in front now. But this time, you guys, we're gonna work the arms just a little bit different because we did this for one minute already. I'm just gonna have you guys do, um, you're gonna go drop, front raise. Drop, front raise for those shoulders, okay? All right, we got one minute. Here we go. Get that leg in front. Let's do it. Drop and raise. Drop and raise. Perfect. Drop and raise. You got it. Keep those abs nice and tight, you guys. You're doing wonderful. Keep going. I'm gonna look for the next. I wanna see what the, our next move is here. Keep it moving. Keep it going. I'm trying to read my writing. I wasn't kidding. Side. Keep it going, guys. Push. I bet you we got three seconds or ten seconds. <laughs> like I said, every time I check the clock, that's where we're at. Good job. Okay. Turn side. Drop. I don't know what I got here. Get some water. I have turn side. Drop all the way down. To knee pivot to other side. I don't even know. <laughs> okay, I think what it's saying here, I'm going like this, drop down, up, press, drop all the way down, turn and press. I believe that that's what I said. <laughs> I gotta stop making these workouts at 11 o'clock at night. That's my problem. Okay, how are we doing? Are we doing okay? All right. Hi, Mindy. Thanks, just me and you, girl. Just me and you in the room. Okay, so this is what we're doing. We're gonna do the pivot, so be careful on this, Mindy. Hi! Okay, so we're gonna do a pivot turn, then pivot, and then up and press, okay? All right, so let's do this. Here we go. We're gonna do drop all the way down, turn and push, just like that. Drop down, turn it, push. There we go. And push. Drop. Now, be nice and controlled with these, okay? You don't wanna go super fast on these because you wanna make sure that you're lining up those knees and hips and ankles. You wanna make sure that you're dropping straight down that the knee does not go over the ankle, right? Okay, push. Down and press. Let's go guys, come on, push. Nice job, awesomeness, okay. So, now we're gonna go into narrow push-ups, okay? So we gotta, we're gonna work a lot of uh, triceps on this one. So come on down. All right, let me grab my notes. Narrow push-up on the knees, okay? You can do this. So come on back. Now, what, or what I want to make sure you guys do, I always lay down, I bring my hands right next to the sides of my armpits, bring them out, then I come up on my knees. Now I wanna make sure that when I do go down, that I'm keeping my chin in front of my fingertips because a lot of times people end up back here and then they end up doing one of those. <laughs> so you wanna make sure that you stay nice and flat and that you drop down, okay? Are you ready? Okay, here we go. Let's do it. Nice and controlled. Now, let's, we're gonna do like half of these normal push-up, right? But then in, in the other half, we're gonna have you bring your hands in to narrow things up and 
you're going to hit more of your triceps. Okay, so about now, let's bring those hands in a little bit narrow, and you're gonna graze those elbows along your side. Got it? Okay. Perfect. Keep it going. You can really feel these. I know I'm feeling these in my shoulders and my triceps and my chest. Okay, come on, keep it going. Almost there. You do as many as you can, you go at your own pace. Gotta reach back, stretch that out just a little bit. Those are tough, those are tough. All right, now, we're gonna come up and I've got two more exercises for us. So come on up. We're gonna do like a figure eight kind of thing, kind of sorta. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna put your right leg in front, you're gonna come down and under, okay? I'm gonna just go to one dumbbell instead of two. So you're gonna come just like this and then switch, and then switch. Okay, so see how I'm switching my legs and then I'm just taking that dumbbell underneath and like threading it through, okay? Then we're gonna come on our back, do an ab exercise, and we are done. All right, perfect. Okay, here we go. So once again, it's like an alternating lunge threading through with the arm. Here we go. Let's do it. Just like that. You can add a hop or just keep it as a step back, however you wanna do it. Optional. Just coming down, threading it through. Let's go. There you go. Yeah, my left knee for whatever reason. Not happy today. Keep going. Right it on in. Come on, guys. Nice job. Okay, on our back. All right, come on down. All we're gonna do is you're just gonna come up, and I used to call these crazy eights because once again you're kind of threading through in an eight motion. All right. Last exercise and then we are done. Here we go, guys. Legs are up. You can bend your knees if you need to, whatever. Whatever works. Here we go. Come under, in and under. There we go. Perfect. Move those legs. The dumbbell, honestly, is just like a distraction. <laughs> That's all it is just to kind of keep you occupied. If this bothers your neck, then just take the legs, take the double out, and then just hold on to the neck, and then just keep those legs moving, okay? That's really all it's about, is those legs, okay? Come in and under. I can feel these, what about you guys? Woo! Good job. Oh, that felt great. All right, time to stretch out. We'll just kind of stay right here. Bring those arms overhead and hold it. Nice stretch. Reach. Now bring one leg in, point the toe, and then extend the other one down. Point and flex. Take that leg across and stretch that out. Take this arm and reach the other direction. All right, now switch. This leg comes in, point and flex. Hold it. And then take this leg over as you reach out with the opposite arm. 
or with that same side arm. All right, bring those knees in, slowly roll yourself up. Now you're gonna sit up, we'll just take one leg out and we're gonna lean forward there. Hold up. Just feeling the stretch in that back of the leg there. This one's a tough side for me. I don't really have any range of motion. I have issues like with my lower back and stuff there, so hold it. Perfect, okay. Come on up, nice and easy, guys. Okay, well I hope you enjoyed the workout. Thanks for sticking around, Mindy. And it is six o'clock, yay, so we got everything in, even though I started a little bit later. But uh, I will be back on Friday morning. You are welcome. I hope you enjoyed it. Welcome back, Mindy. I hope you're feeling good and well. And uh, I will see you on Friday morning at 530. See you guys.